Hi, welcome back to our channel Auto Car News. Today I will review again about the cars for you, so watch and listen carefully. Remember to subscribe to our channel. Thank you. 2017 Maserati 11 SQ4 First Test, the Maser Rocky, or Monster ATI. If you haven't yet, you will start seeing a swanky, new Italian SUV on the road, parked prominently by valets at fancy restaurants, and vying for attention at ritzy country clubs. But Maserati is determined for its new 11 not just to get noticed, it also seeks to challenge the luxury sport utility leaders with its performance and polish. Sure, in profile it may borrow the styling palette of others, say, Infinity Strength Setting FX, but that large grille, it would look better with chrome streaks. With its Deltail Trident and the Set de logo on its C pillars are unmistakable cues to a storied history few others can claim. Criticize if you must, and it has some easily corrected missteps, but the 2017 Maserati Levant is a serious entry into the segment and will take attention and sales from the current luxury sport utility darlings. It's no secret that Maserati, part of Fiat Chrysler Automobiles FCA, has intended for years to produce an SUV. The reason? Luxury sport utilities are big business and make big profits. Just ask Porsche what SUVs have meant for them. Maserati first showed the Juga Euro styled Cubang GT wagon concept in Detroit in 2003 and the Cubang SUV in Frankfurt five years ago. That more recent Cubang was based on FCEA stride and true WK2 Grand Cherokee platform, like the Jeep. It was expected to be built in Michigan, but rumored to be fitted with a Ferrari Maserati F136 V8 or even a V12. That was then. Somewhere in its long marination, everything changed, including the name. As is the Maserati tradition, the Cubang, a Javanese wind, withered and became the Levant, technically a region on the Iberian Peninsula in eastern Spain. Maserati says the name was inspired by a warm, Mediterranean wind that can change from mild to gale force in an instant. You know, like a Mistral, or Ghibli. Far more important than the name change Maserati deemed the production Levant would be derived from the Ghibli, Quattroport sedan platform and be assembled entirely in its own plant near Turin, Italy. Like the sedans, it would have frameless windows, and its power comes via Maserati's new 3.0-liter twin-turbo V6 with two initial states of tune. Perhaps a third version with 500 plus HP will come later. Gone with the wind. All 11 skip the same shiftable 8-speed ZF automatic with both a console shifter and pedals. The base engine produces 345 horsepower.